Hello guys, uh, this is Rahul here. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to install uh, Leva ROM on your Lenovo A390. So, uh, download link I have given in the description section. Okay, so once you have downloaded the Leva ROM and the supporting patch and uh, put it on your SD card, um, this is the step that you need to follow. So, for that, first uh, reboot into recovery mode. So do a power off, ok. Ok, so now uh, to rebo uh, re uh, reboot into recovery what you have to do is press the power button for a short duration. Yeah, so once you feel the vibration, just start pressing the volume up button. Okay, so this is how you boot into recovery in Lenovo A390. Okay, so now what you have to do is to install the Leva ROM, first do the wipes that is wipe data and factory reset. So use volume button for navigation and power button for selection. Okay, so wipe data and factory reset done. Now uh, uh, do a wipe cache partition as well. Okay, that is also done. Now uh, come to advanced and do a wipe Dalvi cache. Okay, you may or may not wipe the battery stats. Okay, so once that is done, just uh, go to the main screen where you will get the option to install zip from SD card. Come down and yeah, actually choose zip from SD card. Okay, so now uh, navigate to where you have uh, copied the Leva ROM. So you can see the folder is already there on my SD card since I had already installed it once. Okay, so just come to this Leva1.zip. Uh, the download link will be there in the description. Just select it and click on install. So you will get this uh, nice interface showing the progress of the installation. Uh, Leva OS is a uh, very popular OS and uh, something on the lines of MIUI, definitely not MIUI but still has a very nice interface that I will be showing you once the installation is done. So actually you can see that the installation is going on now almost done yeah so just click on next
Okay. okay so it took some time but the installation is done now okay so now what you have to do is install the fix as well so the fix is actually for fm radio so the download link for that as well is there in the description section so if you come down here i have placed the uh, fix that is artm underscore fix dot zip so just install it okay so it says that the installation is complete now what you have to do is just reboot the system now yeah so this is the uh, boot animation for Liva Since it is a first boot, it will take some time. Pretty nice boot animation. Uh, not sure actually whether it is visible on the camera or not but uh, there are some nice animation going on on the screen now okay so here we are the installation is done and we are safely booted into the Liva ROM uh, I will be posting the complete review of this ROM in my next video please have a look okay so pretty nice interface nice looks and uh, like I was telling it's uh, not exactly MIUI but still has similar features so like you saw here you can allow like whatever pop-ups are coming just handle those go to settings and you can see that the settings are also very nice I hope you liked it. Uh, please like and subscribe. Thank you guys. See you in the next video.